Hello everyone, this is Man the Black Hat. And this is A Plus Gamer firing off rounds in the beer tent. Haha. <laughs> Anyways, we're back for more Let's Play Metroid Other M on RedzoWalkers.com. Little opening monologue here. The threat of Metroids and space pirates had seemingly disappeared from galactic society. Samus receives a distress call known as Baby's Cry while flying through space. Something stirs within her, and Samus sets open the distress call to. Ah, screw it. <laughs> so, yeah. Adam Alkovich, Anthony Higgs. She decided to stay on the bottle ship! Yeah, really. All caps. Bottle ship! Because this is how we talk in the English language! We all talk like William Shatner! Yeah. Okay, so. I see we're just before the first boss here, pretty much. Pretty much. Oh, got a little first boss time. Yep. Just in case the game thought you were getting bored. Well, you gotta have your introductory boss. Yeah, pretty much. He's Ooh. dead. He's got green jello all Someone over him. or something attacked him. He was a Kool-Aid man. Oh. Yeah, that's gotta hurt. Get away what? from me! <laughs> and over here, much? Why wouldn't you just step on it? It was obvious Maybe that there was some really pervasive going. danger Whoa! throughout the facility. Yeah, really. I didn't know what had brought Adam here. Samus but I did know that cooperation was imperative if we were to restore actor. safety. She's a robot. She Adam cannot emote for anything. Clearly this facility Adam is in complete me. disorder. Clearly this facility it might be is too in dangerous complete for disorder. To go alone. I am acting. That's why I've... Why are you what? Oh, well, because this place is infested with Rangers, doesn't it? Um... Ew! Tentacle monster time! Alright, man, I know where this is going. Alright, man, that's me! Open fire! Yeah, good luck with that! Have fun, guys! Despite the fact that... Die! Bitch, smack. This ain't good! Nothing's working! Listen up! Free guns authorized! Well, that's nice. Sam, I'm authorizing missile you! I love how they have to do this little twirl in order to get their freeze guns out. Yeah. Sam is just like, I'm not having any of that. Nor a missile. Because I'm authorized. Oh, I will have lots to say about the authorization. Yeah. I know you said that it's because she respects him. Let's just say there are moments down the road where she's borderline stupid for how much she so called respects him. Uh, in the face. Concentrate fire in a single location and Ow. freeze that thing! And Sam, you attack the frozen spot! Wow, actual tactics. Well, I'm actually impressed that they're actually doing something aside from standing there and being killed. Well, hey, Even they're moving around when they're not getting their legs swept out from under them. What? If, that happened, if that happened to you five or six times, you'd be dead. So, no, why are they in power? And they're men. Which is the ultimate message of this game, men are men are good. I agree, disclaimer, but, um... It is a Team Ninja game. If this is a Team Ninja game, how come Samus isn't having way more jiggle physics? Um, because we haven't talked about her in the game yet, more or less. Well, we've already seen her in her Zero Suit. Yeah, but we don't wish off the best part of the game right away. Well, this is Team Ninja. They love showing them off some jiggle physics. I know, but it's also Metroid. You have to upgrade Samus. to that. Oh, right. Start with the armor and work down. This mission. But, Shit. 
I'm also going to have to ask that you follow my commands. You don't move unless I say so. Um, and you don't fire until I say so. Adam, why do you have to even ask this? N7! Any objections, lady? The thumbs up sign had been used by the Galactic Federation for ages. Apparently, this is uh, Adam Maybe. Shepard. I was known for giving that the thumbs down to the briefing. Sense. Yep. I had my reasons, though. To have him be a dick. Commander Adam Malkovich was normally cool and not one to jump around. Which actually kind of makes Samus into he would end Samus all his Nora Naraya. Any objections, lady? Yeah, it kind of does. He was joking, that analogy is but others weren't. Well. <laughs> At the time, I felt surrounded by people who treated me like a child. At the time, I, I felt like I was surrounded by people woman. who treated me like a child, or used kid gloves because I and was a woman. And yet, with Adam, I was grateful for the nod. And yet, with Adam, I was grateful for the nod. My past has left me with an uneasy soul. My past has left me with an uneasy soul. It touched I'm me acting. on some level that Adam would acknowledge that past by calling me something delicate. What a like, robot! That's all I can say to that. And I knew well, more than anyone that I, every I, word from Adam was. I'm delivered. sure they told the voice actress to. My thumbs act down like was a twofold response. Stress disorder, which Samus a sign does. of derision, being called a lady. I know, but and I don't a think signal of my complete understanding of the mission orders. If she has PTSD, the other soldiers were always a, willing to support me with mine. easy smiles, despite the and fact that I clearly had so much yet to pretty learn. Pretty severe, actually. Among them was okay, Anthony. I can appreciate the fact that in real life, the face of his well-meaning behavior and that of the other soldiers. But you don't put that in a video game. It's not was like to okay. Uh, we bigger. just saw Samus get her butt kicked on Zebes. I was so a child. We're gonna have the player her face always with six something to prove. Real-time rehabilitation. There was something you can leave out. Speaking of was rehab, is it I felt just that if I let my guard down, I would easily be broken. Actually, feel like Samus is telling that, someone this story. Pretty I'm much scared. Like maybe she's maybe already, already in rehab, and, and all of the Metroid series is her actually recounting everything in her life. I could see in Adam's joking manner how close he felt to me. To a psychiatrist. Yeah. Adam knows my past. Either that, or maybe it's just one of the delusions of the power of the Metroid series in a straitjacket. <laughs> Which would account for so much in this series. Because I was um, so young when so, I lost um, both my parents, there's yes, no Doctor, question uh, I saw today, Adam as a I'm father figure. I the time that I fought my evil phase on him too, so, yes. Uh, well, we were uh, on phase, against him. and um, uh, I told him a big pit, and I, I was phase on him. And, uh, uh, and uh, his uh, paternal compassion in the face yeah, of my rebellion yeah, reinforced yeah, the special yeah. bond I felt with him. But no, this, this actually I understood does feel well like that chances were slim that I would ever find anyone that understood me like Adam. Pretty much recounting everything. And yet, yeah. like when the time all of this came, narration that's side, in every single Metroid game I was so young. is actually years after the fact. Young and naive. Certainly possible, uh, and it certainly would fit with things. Exactly what transpired here on the At least this isn't is a Kojima game. Here's what we do know. Uh, who's sorry? The equipment we thought had been destroyed Hideo was Kojima. Oh, yes, yes, yes. We've seen yes. casualties attributed to an unidentified Then the message creature. would be even more heavy-handed. The situation is critical. We need to gather all the information we can, but well, I mean, priority one find is to find any survivors and bring them the to safety. And, uh, the Galactic Federation Consider this site extremely dangerous. Actually, careful well, as you make your sweeps. I better shut up. Wait, the Galactic Federation is evil. And there's one problem. Yeah. Okay, it's a wireless Can interference in this facility is all pervasive. <laughs> Your comm systems are useless. We all just live in it and play games. Well, As a result, the thing about the communication channels will be limited to the facility's navigation booths. All no, that's actually not true. Lyle, um, investigate Sector 1. There is only one and Mother Brain. There is a technology the Federation gotcha. built that mimics Maurice, Earth, but Mother Brain has you cover Sector design. 2. True. Repair any of the Confederation built. They're building the same style of Sector 3. But uh, they have to decide whether plasma guns are called for. All right, James, check out the control bridge. Our communication issues might be the result of electrical interference. Yes, sir. The L9000 protocol? Run a complete sweep of the residential quarters and investigate any trace of survivors. Got it. 
Each of it's you is nice authorized to use the phrase Anthony gun. Higgs and Adam Do not Malcolm forget to check in regularly actors. via navigation booths. It is. Actually, I, I will say this. As, as and much Samus, as I kick on the game, you go to the system management it does have room. Some nice things. Do everything Adam you can Malcolm to get the electrical Higgs. system back up and running. Um, even Samus Aran, if she could emote Looks like your comm system anything, is still functional. Wouldn't be a bad voice actor. Hey, Remember, at least everything you see not will also appear on the screen. Regarding auxiliary weapons, use of bombs has been authorized. As far as uh, other weapons, we will continue to investigate and authorize use as we can. However, and there's we currently have no impact. plans to authorize the use yeah, of power bombs. Very true. As you know, they have the ability to spread a high temperature Personally, heat wave over a large area, impacting living things. Which is a nice way of saying they can it's vaporize humans opinion. instantly. You should be well aware of how dangerous power bombs are and how their devastation can't be obstructed with common materials. Yeah, Once the mission in the system management device. room is complete, I need you to really? report back. Yeah. I'll give you your next orders then. I want you all power to be especially careful as you execute your missions. Did not know this. Um... That's the end of the briefing. And you probably spammed the hell out of the It's the first joint mission I've been a part of since Super becoming Android a freelance yeah. bounty hunter. Uh, actually, and of no, course, I, I, it was I, the I first time since my Federation days that I was following the orders of a commanding officer. That's kind of weird, though, that there would be Adam, doors on Zebs I felt that require confused a thermal and nuclear weapon to unlock. at the unexpected turn of events. I responded. Point range, uh, Understood, Adam. Interesting fact. You know what that is? Yeah, it's actually Zeb is. It's not, uh, I always used to say Zebs. Yeah, I think most people pronounce it that way since, you know, for 20 so, some odd years, it's been without anyone actually pronouncing it for us. Yeah. Bomb activated. So, we have bombs now. And missiles. And zoomers. Okay. Ow. You know that part where Adam said you don't fire unless I tell you? He wasn't being literal, you know. That wasn't game instructions. You are allowed to kill the enemy. Bad. Oh. You skipped a save point. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's okay. Whee! Sam what? Samus, what are you... Damn it, Samus. Stop pumping the rail. I know you're lonely, but damn. Yeah, what am I saying? What I don't get is why do the zoomers go after Samus? They should they should know really well that Samus is an extreme danger to them. Yeah, yeah but if you in were all other iterations go after her? In all other iterations, zoomers usually ignore you or stay away from you. No, they don't. Super Metroid, Metroid Zero Mission, they just run in circles. Oh, oh yes, yes, sorry, my mistake. I was thinking of something else. I was thinking of the little bats that come down from the ceiling. And my what? point about that is this. If you were, if you wa if you saw Samus Aran coming past you, wouldn't you go after her? Good point. Yeah. And of course, there's always the debates on who has the better power armor, Samus Aran or Master Chief. Given the in-game content for Halo, I would have to say Samus's power armor is vastly superior. Agreed. For one thing, it has a built-in plasma cannon. For another thing, it has a built-in tactical nuclear device. Yeah. It also breaks the speed of sound, has jetpacks on the rear, well, and on shoulders. it has better use of the term breastplate, that's all you need. <laughs> and of course it's got the Mandalorian style T-Visor. Yep. Integrated weapon systems, much better equipment, and an integrated like... shield system that far outperforms the Mjolnir armor. Yeah. I feel like I should correct something, though. Uh, in your first episode, you said that Al Adam Malkovich was Samus's lover. Yeah. No, 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 no. A father figure. Only in Japan 
would he also be her lover? And actually, that was kind of this is true, game. and this game was made where Adam Malkovich is the father figure in Upset. At no point were they lovers. This is Nintendo. Uh huh. And Nintendo is immune from weird, insane stuff when, since when? Um, since they expected the Nintendo Wii to be taken seriously. Doki Doki Panic. I'm sure that there's a reason you're making that reference, I'm just not sure what it is. Super Mario Brothers 2? It was all in the game? I know what it is, I'm just not sure how it falls into the reference of Nintendo being immune to perversity. They're not immune to weird shit, is what I'm trying to say. In fact, they kind of use weird shit all the time. Whee! Besides, the Metal Gear series started on the Nintendo. Yes, but that was before Hideo got, uh, Hideo got, his, got his hands on it. Not true, I don't think. I think Hideo is the one who started Metal Gear. No, nope, he came in in Metal Gear Solid. Huh. Okay. Bouncy, 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 bouncy. Dead? No. And... Yep. You know, I like these better in this game, where it takes just a teensy amount of skill to kill them instantly. I have to agree there, and aside from that, they also tend to do way too much damage in other Metroid games. Yeah, and they're just damage sponges in the other games. A blue dot will appear once all the enemies around that item are defeated. But you can still find it if you know where the hell to go. Blue dots in the map show the location of items. Well, at least you could if the game wasn't completely linear and forced you to pretty much beat every enemy encounter one at a time. Well, there is some backtracking, like any Metroid game, but... There is, but even most of the time that you do that, you're still, you, you still always go forward. Very rarely do you have to go backwards over your path to get back to where you started. True, although we will run into some areas that almost require us to backtrack. If nothing else, for items. There's, this is true, but that's not part of the game's progression. Uh, example. In Super Metroid, look at Meridia. There's two com completely viable ways to get to uh, Dragoon in the Meridia area of Super Metroid. This is true. You can either go through the wrecked ship and go through Eastern Zebe Eastern Kateria, go down from the surface and that way, or you could power bomb the pipe. Not once. Is there that kind of choice in this game? Yeah, that's true. Anyways, it looks like we're coming up on the end of this episode, so... This is Man in the Black Hat. And A-Plus Gamer. And we'll see you next time for more Let's Play Metroid Other M on Have a good one. Later.